Yeah, so we are closing early today due to the, you know, obviousness of the season. Um, yeah, we're closing at 5 p.m. today, and, and that is a tight 5 p.m., okay? Because, I mean, none of us want to be here at the best of times, let alone tonight, okay? Mm, sorry, no, 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 fucking no chance. No, we ran out of stock of that fucking weeks ago. Like, maybe you should have had a little bit of fucking forethought and, you know, not turned up at literally the last fucking minute, but... No, no, cheers for the laugh. Go, go try a few doors down, I'm sure he could do with a laugh as well, because, I mean, nowhere's got that. No, 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 I don't give a fuck that it's only two minutes past five, okay? You're not coming in, right? You've had all fucking day, nine goddamn hours to come in and shop, as well as the entire rest of the cunting year. So fuck off, okay? You don't need to come in here no more. I want to go home. Buying presents the day before? Good fucking luck. Um, yeah, we might have some, I don't know, oven cleaner kits dotted around the place. Uh, the odd Lynx gift set that we have a million of every fucking year. But other than that, I mean, Christ, do you not like your family or something? Are you dense? Why the fuck would we be open tomorrow? Who the fuck needs to come out shopping on Christmas Day? No, I don't give a shit. You don't need to come out, okay? Just because you don't have a life doesn't mean that we don't either. Um, yeah, funny. It's, it's a really weird one, but um, no, the after Christmas sale, for some reason, I can't figure it out, um, that's actually starting after Christmas. It's weird. I don't know. It's almost as if the clue's in the fucking name. No, no, we can't hold any stock over for you. Why? Because there's fucking 10 minutes to close on Christmas Eve, okay? None of us are staying a second later than we fucking have to. Least of all, for some ill-prepared fuckhole like you. I don't know. Save the fucking money and use it for therapy sessions, I guess. Maybe you're just a shit father. Yeah, I mean, I'm sorry you feel that way. I mean, I'm not. I just, I'm contractually obliged to say that, but... It's Christmas Eve, mate. You didn't think it'd be a little bit fucking busy? I mean, it's not our fault that we're so goddamn busy. In fact, if anything, it's your fault and everybody else here who decided to fucking bum rush us on what is obviously going to be a busy fucking day. Mate, we this is this is a fucking car parts shop, okay? What makes you think that we sell any kind of food, least of all fucking turkeys? Honestly, you're so shit out of luck that your best bet is going down and getting a net from aisle five. Oh, fuck you. No, I'm not checking out the back for it. No, there's no chance that we've got it. That toy is the most popular one of the fucking year, okay? We've sold hundreds of them in October. They're gone, all right? I'm not wasting my time walking out back looking for something that isn't there, okay? Go cry about it somewhere else. Mate, we, we don't sell any kind of food whatsoever, okay? Least of all fucking turkeys. Honestly, you're so shit out of luck that your best bet, go down to aisle five, get a net, and try and catch a fucking pigeon, okay? That's literally the best option you've got today. I mean, seriously, you've, you've left it far too fucking late for any of us to give a shit. No, I'm not checking out back for it. Because it's the most popular toy we've had this fucking Christmas, okay? We don't have it. Have you not seen Jingle All The Way? Fucking, if Arnold Schwarzenegger can barely fucking find one on Christmas Eve, then you've got no chance. In fact, that was fucking, what, Thanksgiving as well. You're shit out of luck. You ain't no fucking Arnie. Good evening, this is a customer announcement. I would just like to remind everybody that we will be closing in a matter of minutes. And if that is not enough of an incentive for you to hurry your slow asses up, I have also alerted the local traffic wardens that they are probably going to reach their quota with parking tickets if they come and check the car park outside. Because I know that if you're shopping in here right now, you're a bunch of cheap motherfuckers who sure as shit have not paid for parking properly. So, uh, TikTok bitches, hurry up! What do you mean you don't have any lefty stock? It, I know, it's it's weird. It's it's this really weird thing. So, it's, it's odd. What's been happening lately is we keep putting stock on the shelves and then people fucking take it. And then they just give us money and then I'm like, oh, okay, I've got to put more stock on the shelves. But then more people turn up and take it as well. Seems like every time we put something that we want to sell out available to sell, it fucking sells. It's, it's bizarre, I don't know. Yeah, it's that is not obviously the way that our business model is designed to run, clearly. 
Right, okay, we know what time of year it is, we know what's going to happen, okay? So, Phil, Gary, I want you to go and lock the doors now, okay? Other Phil, other Gary, other, other Phil, I want you three manning the exit doors, okay? I don't want anybody coming in. I don't care if you have to use weapons and aggressive violence, all right? No fucker is getting past you, okay? Everybody else? Let's grab a broom, head to the back of the store, and we're gonna sweep these fuckers right down to the checkouts so that we can get out on time, okay? Let's see if we could do this this year without drawing any blood. But again, if it's customers, honestly don't care as long as we get out on time. Uh huh. Yeah. No, no, I understand. That's fair enough. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Bye. So, uh, so Marcus has just phoned in sick, um, but he didn't really give a reason other than can't be asked. you don't pay me enough, and honestly, that's pretty fucking valid. Oh, it's far too fucking early for this, okay? I, I consumed 40,000 calories yesterday. Unless there's a fucking toilet underneath the checkout, today is going to be quite literally shit. Look at all these pathetic fuckers. How long have they been queuing up waiting for our depressingly minimal sales? Can you imagine having so little of a life that it's exciting to wake up at 6am on a fucking boxing day to go and get some discount Christmas shit? You clearly don't celebrate it if you're here. <sighs> oh well, we don't open the door for another two hours so hopefully it will start raining. Hmm? No, no, of course I'm not hungover, right? I'm not hungover. I'm actually still fucking drunk. So, you've got two choices. I can either fucking keep drinking, keep this buzz going, might actually help my attitude, or I can stop drinking, and some point after lunch, I will just fucking die. What do you want to do? Hello? Yes, obviously we are fucking open today. How else would somebody answer the goddamn phone? Fucking hell, look at them. Literally sprinting through the shop like sheep in a slaughterhouse. All that, all that. Look, look at that, he fucking lost a tooth. Fucking lost it just for some discount tinsel. Pathetic. Fuck it, we'll take that money. <laughs> okay guys, the rules are really simple, okay? We're gonna play this little drinking game because I think it's the only way we're gonna survive the fucking day. So, any time any customer says to you the following phrase or any variation upon it, you take a shot, okay? So any time you hear, oh, I think it's so bad that you have to work on Boxing Day, we take a shot, yeah? And if any of us make it to lunchtime, it'll be a Christmas fucking miracle. Sir, this is a chain store, okay? Not a fucking market store. The price is what the price is. I'm not haggling here with you. If you don't like the prices, just fucking steal it. Everybody else does. Please don't care, I don't care. Fucking just go. This is an employee announcement. Would all employees please vacate the shop floor as we are about to open the main doors and let the uh, living zombie apocalypse enter the premises and corporate would prefer that no staff members get trampled this year. Thank you. Oh, I think it's just terrible that you have to work today. Yeah, I'm gonna have to call bullshit on that, okay? Like, you're the reason I'm fucking here. Okay, you couldn't just wait another couple of days to come in and get some fucking bleach and some bird seed. Honestly, great, wonderful. Really happy that I left my family at home to come in and serve you impatient fucking bitch. Thank you, thank you so much. Have a wonderful fucking day, cunt. This is a customer announcement. We would just like to remind customers not to physically fight for items in our sales section as most of our first aiders are far too hungover and apathetic to deliver any form of adequate treatment. So we will be instituting a Darwinism style first aid approach, which is basically survival of the fittest. Okay, everybody who's queuing up looking to get a refund, um, I just need you to step over here, but only if you have a gift receipt or a transaction receipt. If you don't, there's the exit. Kindly fuck off, okay? We are not going to be giving you money for goods just because your family doesn't care enough to get you something you like, okay? Bye. You, you want to speak to a manager? You, you, Phil! Other Phil! Other, other Phil! And that Phil! This guy wants to speak to a fucking manager. <laughs> Dude, it's fucking Boxing Day. You think anybody who has any modicum of power in this fucking company is coming to work today? 
Jesus Christ. But maybe find someone whose paycheck is not in six digits, all right? Christ, you can speak to me if you want, but I'm just gonna laugh at you. If you want to speak to a manager, come back in fucking January. Maybe then you'll have a better shot. Fucking idiot.